going on everyone? It's your favorite Mango here, and today I'm going to be reviewing the cargo helicopter. So I know a lot of you guys wanted this, so I decided to do it. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and join our Discord server to never miss a video, and let's get right into this. So I wanted to start off with the fact that this thing has a really good amount of HP. It has 1,300 HP, and it can fly really high, so it's quite hard to hit. Damage wise, you cannot one hit, but the maximum amount of damage you can do is 175 damage, which is insane. Alright guys, so I know this doesn't matter to many of you, but I gotta point out that this thing is insanely fast. As you can see, it, it I can track down a biplane for a good amount of time. Sadly, the cargo helicopter does not have homing missiles. If a cargo helicopter is really good for team domination, as you can see, people like camping B a lot, and when you can't B, it's really easy for the cargo helicopter to hit you many, many times because of its really good aiming, and it just, the missiles travel very far, they do a lot of splash damage, and yeah, it's really easy to kill people with it in team domination. When you're playing with the cargo helicopter, you really have to fly high because if you don't, people are just going to start shooting you over and over again, which is not really the best. Um, if you're flying low, people are going to see you and you're just going to get easily killed because 1,300 HP isn't much when you're getting fired at lot many times so there are lots of good things about the cargo helicopter but there are some weaknesses to it so one weakness is when you are going quite low like I am right now and I consider this low you will get shot and killed really quickly by land people so people on land who are actually looking are a weakness because once they see you they can do major damage to you Another weakness is that the missiles travel insanely slow. As you can see, they, they are so slow. It's probably the slowest firing missiles in the game, other than the RPG, probably. They fire slow for a vehicle. Another weakness is that this cargo helicopter cannot hit a plane for its life. And so... When you're shooting, it normally aims a bit downward, and also, as you can see, it aims, uh, it has two sets of missiles. If you shoot up there, one of them will fire from there. If you shoot from there, one of them will fire from there. So, um, the aim is kind of off sometimes, and I just missed like that. Uh, really annoying, so if you have bad aim with missiles in general, just don't get this. Unless you want to work on them. Alright guys, now we're going to move on to the tips and tricks section of this video. The first tip is to never fly low. As I said, you should, you should always have good aim with this. And since you have good aim, then just fly high. Don't get shot. Don't die like that guy. Tip number two is never stay still in the air. It is... You will get shot so many times if you stay still. Look at this. I. What? Helicopter So as you can see, I'm already really low. Tip number three is about the price. Don't get this if you're a starter. Don't even get the helicopter if you're a starter. I suggest getting one of the planes first and just fighting on land. But once you are more experienced at the game, then get the cargo helicopter. Alright guys, that's it for the tips and tricks part of the video. Now, it's montage time. Alright guys, I think that's going to be it for the video. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and join the Discord server. Links are in the description below. And I rate the cargo helicopter a 9 out of 10. It is a very good flying vehicle. Definitely suggest you get it. And Ultra Mango out!